acid halide reacts with water to yield carboxylic acid so if i have acid halide and this is treated with water we will have a carboxylic acid this reaction is a nucleophilic acyl substitution reaction so this reaction is nucleophilic acyl substitution so basically we have replaced this x that is halogen with an oh group so this reaction is a substitution because halogen is substituted by by oh group since this substitution is happening on acyl carbon that's why this is acyl substitution so substitution is taking place on acyl carbon let us discuss mechanism of this reaction so we have acid halide this reacts with water and this gives acid let us take a special case of acid chloride so we have acid chloride and this reacts with water this time water will act as a nucleophile and this will attack on carbonylic carbon so this step is nucleophilic attack or you can say nucleophilic addition of h2o and this bond opens so we will have this molecule oxygen will have a positive formal charge and this oxygen will have a negative formal charge this intermediate is called tetrahedral intermediate so this is tetrahedral intermediate basically it can be deprotonated so we have this intermediate and this can lose h plus so that it can have oh group so this is again tetrahedral intermediate after deprotonation and this step is simply deprotonation so this step is deprotonation now in the next step this negative charge can expel this cl minus and finally we will have acid plus cl minus now in this step we have released one mole of h plus so this h plus and this cl minus can combine so finally we will have rcooh and hcl as the product 
if i want this reaction to go in the forward direction we can destroy hcl that is we can neutralize hcl so to make this reaction in the forward direction in the forward direction we have to neutralize HCl and this can be generally done by adding a small amount of NaOH or pyridine. So, neutralization of HCl is generally done by adding NaOH or pyridine. So, pyridine is a base. So, in this lecture we discussed about hydrolysis of acid halide. Acid halide can be easily hydrolyzed in the presence of water. Like other derivatives requires catalyst, acid halide does not require any catalyst it can be simply hydrolyzed in the presence of water and the reaction is nucleophilic attack by H2O it gives tetrahedral intermediate and then halogen is a good leaving group so in the next step we have to expel the halogen so in this step halogen in this case chloride is a good leaving group For another acid derivatives, this group is not a good leaving group. For example, if you have amide, you will have this tetrahedral intermediate and this time you will have NH2 as a leaving group. So, this is not a good leaving group. In case of ester, you will have O or minus is the leaving group. This is also not as good as X minus. So, this is not as good as X minus that is halogen. That is why hydrolysis of acid halide is fastest among all acid derivatives. 